So you've gotten yourself a RAR file and it ends in .rar here and you need to know how to open it up in Windows. This is gonna work in Windows 11 and Windows 10. And as you can see here, for us, it's just a paper icon. For you, it may be a stack of books. It may be a 7-zip file, maybe anything. And if you have one of those programs, go uninstall them. You don't need WinRAR, you don't need 7-zip, you don't need anything like that. I don't have it, you don't have it, and I've never needed it. And I do tutorials and I work on the computer all day, right? So go uninstall those programs. They're just taking over files your computer that they really shouldn't be using, right? You don't need to open up zip files with WinRAR or 7-zip. The only files that they might need to be used for is something like a RAR file. And guess what? We're going to show you how to open it without those programs in this video. So let's go ahead and do that. First though, I do want to make sure that you have a RAR file. For some of you, you may not have .rar at the end. If that's the case, go ahead and right click on this file, click on properties, and you'll be able to see what type of file it is. As you can see, this is a RAR file, .rar, right? Awesome stuff. As long as it says that, this tutorial will work for you. Nevertheless, we close out of this. We can go ahead and go to the description of this video. Just click show more under the video and it will show you the description where you have a link to here. This is Cloud Convert. And this is a free service, 100% free, where you can convert stuff from RAR to zip, right? So we're just going to take this RAR file that we've downloaded and convert that to a zip file. And you can click select file here. And when you do, it's going to open up here. Here's our .rar file, texture pack .rar. Double click on it and boom, it loads right on in here. Ours is a pretty small file and we have pretty fast internet. So it was pretty much instant, but for you, it might have to upload upload might take a few seconds. Now let's go ahead and click on the red convert button. And when we do, it's going to convert this file from a RAR file to a zip file without needing those pesky programs like WinRAR or 7-zip or something like that. Now we've got this green download button. Click on that and boom, it downloads in the bottom left of Google Chrome. You may need to save it depending on your browser. But if we minimize our browser, we can go grab it in the downloads folder. So to do that, click the little Windows icon, top down my screen, bottom of your screen, center of your screen on Windows 11, type in downloads and then click on that downloads folder. And there it is. Is texture pack .zip. Now, as you can see, we still have this RAR file on our desktop, but we don't need it. It can be deleted. We've got texture pack .zip now, and guess what? .zip files are natively handled by Windows. Not only can we double click on this and see what's in it, we can extract this very simply by right clicking on texture pack, clicking on extract all, and clicking on extract. Then, boom, we have this texture pack folder right here, which has all of the same stuff that our zip folder has in it. Look at that. Boom. Awesome stuff. You now know how to open WinRAR files. Just convert them. Convert them to zips. Luckily, these files are becoming more and more uncommon in the wild. But if you do download a RAR file, make sure it's safe. Make sure things are good like that and convert it to a zip file. Zip files are the best way to open these and... It just takes the stress out of having to have these other programs that, like I said, they'll take over zip files when they don't need to. They'll take over jar files when they don't need to. These programs, WinRAR, 7-zip, things like that, you don't need them anymore in 2022. So go ahead, get these fixed, and uh, convert your files and open them that way. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Subscribe to the channel so we can get to 10,000. My name is Nick, and I'm out. Peace.